everybody. It's Deb from Dandy Art Gallery. Today I have a 10 by 10 inch gallery wrap canvas. I'm going to do a swipe on it. This is an experiment because I am using uh, the new mix and I'm going to use silicone. So first let's go over my paint by paint choices. Uh, Liquitex Basics Turquoise Blue. Then I have the rest of my paints are King Art. I have uh, King, King Art Crimson Red, um, King Art Purple, King Art Rose, and King Art Lemon Yellow. And I have put down a thin layer of the Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White. And all my paints were mixed seven parts of this mix to one part paint in all of them. And that's all I added, except my swipe color, which is going to be the Artist Loft Flow Acrylic White. I did add three, three drops of the Spot On Treadmill Silicone. I'm gonna to check today to see if we get cells with the mix. Okay, so let's get started. I'm just gonna lay the paints down. So I'll just start with my yellow here. And I did thin these. Let me pick one here that maybe you can see. I did thin them with one drop of water. You can thin the mix with one drop of water. So they're, they're on the thinner side today. So I'll just start with the yellow and I'm going to just do a, a swipe from the middle out. Next I'll go with the red. down some blue and some pink and the last one is the purple And then I'm just going to repeat those layers again. I hope everybody's having a good day today. Or a Monday. Beginning of a new week. I did put white on my edges because, um, if I don't get a perfect, if this paint doesn't flow perfectly over the edges, then I know that they are covered. And the purple. And then I'll just finish up with what I have here.
I tried to um, figure out exactly how much paint I would need for this little canvas. And that's kind of what I've gone with here. Not a whole lot of extra paint. Just squeeze some paint out of there. Let's see if I have any pink left. Okay, get the rest of my blue out here. See if I have some yellow left. I may have some yellow left. Yes, I do. Just using up all the paint I have here. And I may have a little bit of purple left. Looks like I do. Okay, and now I'm going to lay down my swipe color, which is the white with the treadmill silicone in it. Like I said, I'm just going to swipe from the middle out, and I'll try that much first. Well, let's see if we get some cells here. I'm just very lightly pulling it over the paint. Not really putting pressure on it at all. And I am tapping the edges of my painting here. just to give it some coverage. Okay, looks like we're getting a lot of cells up. And I'll turn it to do this side.
just tapping the side over here. I'm just going to do very, very little spot right here on the edge. And I think that'll be it. And I'm going to torch it. And I'm going to just cover my edges here quickly, my corners, make sure everything is covered. Okay, we did get quite a few cells come up and I think that what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do a little bit of tipping. If you know me, the center white does not have to be exactly in the center. I like to play around a little bit with my swipes. And it looks like it's giving some, the lacing effect there. So I'm gonna do some more tipping here and see what we get. Since this is just totally an experiment, And I'm going to bring that back. Okay. Pretty happy with that. I'm just going to take a look here. and torch again, and then I may take my balloon and uh, do a few balloon kisses on this in the center. So now we know that the mix is very reactive to um, silicone. We'll see if I can bring anything up or if it's still too wet and I have to let it sit a little bit. That looks very pretty. I'm wiping my little balloon off after every time I dip it. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm gonna check the bottom. And the sides here. And I'm going to get you down for a close up. Just fixing a corner here. We'll get you down for a close-up.
Okay, here we are for our close-up. This is the upper left-hand corner. And I'll take you down the left-hand side. Very reactive. Here's where I did a, a few of the little balloon kisses through the middle. I love where the cells are bright. And we'll go up the middle here. And then I'll take you over to the right corner and down the right hand side. Very, very pretty. It's pretty in here. And look at red cells with blue cells in, inside of that. It's pretty neat. And here we got some blue cells with yellow inside and yellow with red. Just really turned out nice. Okay, so let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it. Make sure you ring the bell and choose all so you'll know the next time that I do post a new video. And before you go, I do want to show you the dried results of my last video I did where I did use the mix for the first time. And here's that painting. And I just wanted to show you how shimmery and shiny that dried and the the this is with no spray no varnish nothing on it still so vivid and everything stayed the exact same so pretty and i'm hoping that my camera is picking up all the colors so i am very happy with this mix so until next time Take care, everybody. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.